Hey guys, Mariah from MariahMagazine.com here and in this quick tutorial I am just going to show you how to connect Google Analytics to your WordPress website. So in order to do this you kind of already have to have a Google Analytics account so make sure that you are signed into your account and if you don't have one yet then go ahead and create one but once you do that we are going to log into your WordPress dashboard and then in the left hand menu you're going to click on plugins and then you're going to click this add new button up here so the plugin that we're going to use is going to be called monster insights and it looks like this google analytics for wordpress by monster insights so go ahead and click install now and then you're going to click activate once you do that you'll see this little notification bar that says configure your google analytics settings so click that and then you're going to click this blue bar right here that says authenticate your Google Analytics account. So then it's going to pop up your Google account. So go ahead and click which one you have your Google Analytics account for this website set up with and then go ahead and allow it. And then it wants you to pick your profile. So go ahead and choose the Google Analytics account and then you're going to want to click complete authentication. And once you do that, you'll see a profile active with your Google tracking number right here. Now, if you're having problems automatically authenticating, you can click here to do it manually, which will allow you to manually enter your tracking code. But if you do that, you're not going to be able to see the fun reports that show up in your WordPress dashboard. You'll actually have to log into Google Analytics in order to see everything, but totally not a big deal. Um, so in order to get your tracking code, we go back to Google Analytics, sign into your account, and then you're going to come down here to admin, and then under property, we're going to go to property settings, and then you're going to copy this tracking ID right here, and you would paste it right into this box right here. And then scroll down and click save, and that's another way to hook up Google Analytics to your WordPress website. So if you guys have any questions, just go ahead and comment them down below. And if you found this tutorial helpful, please give it just a quick thumbs up. And then make sure that you subscribe so that you don't miss out on any videos I have coming your way.